This is Thagra Grandma. I'm right out here in the middle of the fucking desert. Me and Jake called a plane out here for Area 51. Took us about six hours to get here, motherfuckers. And I'm gonna find out what happened to my damn cow. My cow was abducted when I was little. And the cop told me, oh, she's just missing, missing my eyes. Yeah, she was missing, all right. She's abducted. And I'm going out there, and by hell, I'm going to find out what the fuck they done with my cow. we got to be getting close to Area 51 out here. Because, damn it, look at that side right there. And then the extra, extra rest of, what's that say? Highway. What is it? Extra terrestrial fuck. Well, guys, I guess you're wondering what happened to the Area 21. 51 footage. Well, let, I'm so fucking mad. Well, let me tell you what happened. It wasn't my fault, Granny. It was all fucking Jake's fault. It was your fault. You told no, me to turn boy, down that shit, dirt road. It wasn't my fucking fault. You told me to turn left. That's what the fucking woman said, and you agreed to that that's what she said, motherfucker. So it was your fault. We stopped at this fucking store and got directions to go to the Area 51 gate. Yeah, we went to the gate, all right. We was going down the dirt road, see the dirt road coming in from the left, and Jake said, Granny, that's got to be it. I, I don't know. We went up that fucking dirt road, and I bet you we was on it for a good hour. And I told Jake, I said, Jake, I said, bullshit. We ain't seen nothing or nothing else. I said, turn the fuck around and take us back up, back out. Oh, no, Granny, we'll go over a little further and see if we can see any signs. I thought we were going the right way. So we went a little, about an hour more. Well, what pops up was the fucking sides that we had to look for. Jake said, see, I told you, Granny, I know where I was going. Jake come up on the top of the fucking mountain, and we was, he stopped. We was deciding whether to go over it or just try to turn around and go back. Because you couldn't find a fucking place to turn around once you get on that fucking road. And Jake said, look through his rearview mirror, and he said, Granny! I said, what? He said, they're here. I said, who's here? He said, they're behind us. The white truck. I said, oh, motherfucker. Well, they got us out of the car. Took us, in, uh, took us to the back of the car. They handcuffed our damn dices. They had guns pointed on us. At the same time, I'm telling you, we sat there, I bet you we was there for three hours or longer. Trying to get shit going through everything that we had. It was the fucking military. And they called for backup. And I bet you there's about three more damn trucks pulled up our full of military people. Son of a bitch, they went through our car, Jake's car. They checked every fucking thing that he had. And I seen them checking their pictures on Jake's phone. They went looked at every picture he had on his phone and everything. And she walked over to me and she said, Judy, do you care if we look at your pictures? I said, well, you'll see a dirty one on it, but go ahead. Because somebody had sent me a picture of this man's body and put my head on it, and he had big tits. I said, oh, motherfucker. 
son of a bitch. Well, they still went through with the races. I mean, they had to have know her whole life history and ever fucking thing else. And then to top it off, they called the sheriff. The damn sheriff had to come up there and he had to escort us off of the premises. And then what happened to us, Greg? <laughs> well, he got us down to the fucking main road. We're going down the road. We thought we were safe getting away from him. And mother and lo and behold, Jake's fucking tire on the car blowed out. I mean, that fucker blowed out. I got out of the car and I looked. I said, oh, motherfucker, Jake. I said, this car, this tire is blown out to hell. He got out of the car and come around. I said, well, can you change a tire? He said, no, Granny, I don't know how to change a tire. I said, oh, motherfucker, here we are on the side of the fucking road. Still in this 110 degree heat. I mean heat. They want no breeze or nothing blowing. Sweat just rolling off of fucking both of us. And we stand there and we look. And we see the car coming. Jake said, I'll flag him down. And when he got closer, Jake said, Granny, it's the sheriff. I said, oh, son of a bitch. He pulls up and he stops. He said, now what's wrong? I said, we got a flat tire. And I said, dumb ice here don't know how to change it. Son of a bitch. He was such a nice guy. He changed the tire. He put the dummy tire on. And they wasn't enough air in the dummy tire for us to drive on. So he had to take it back off, put the other tire back on so the car wouldn't fall off the jack. And he took us, he took us up to get air in that tire. We go back and we get it changed. He changes it for us. And me and, he, me and old Jake, we had it out. We fucking left. But in between that, we stopped at this damn bar. Believe it or not, the sheriff dropped us off at the bar while he went and got air in the tire. We walk in that place. We sat out and son of a bitch, I looked up and everybody in that damn place knew who I was, me and Jake. And they said, Granny, where you been up to? Oh, hell, they just got us for going. We went seven fucking miles in there. Seven. I said, oh, they just got us for going seven miles in Area 51. They laughed their damn asses off. I said, hell, we thought we was going to jail. We sat there and we got to thinking we spent four fucking hours in Area 51, went seven miles in there, we didn't see a damn thing. Nothing. We didn't see an alien. We didn't see shit. And to make matters worse, I got about to shit. And when I get about to shit, I got to go. And I asked them, did they have a shitter in there? And they, they said no. I said, can I go behind this fucking bush and take a shit? Mark my territory. I think you would have been the mother. first person to shit inside Area 51, Granny. I'm marking my territory. It's just fucking fly. What? Look at. I got him. Did I get him? I think I killed that motherfucker. Motherfucker, the damn fuck. 
Peace back.